Welcome back to NBA Cinema. We got to talk more about Dame Lillard as he touched down in Milwaukee earlier today. Now we get to see him go in and see his jersey for the first time, his Milwaukee Bucks jersey. His kids was thrilled, everyone ecstatic to see him arrive. You even got Giannis put up this tweet saying, you know, the magic is in the air. So there's a lot of hype around the Milwaukee Bucks coming into this season. And We've expected them to be great in the past just as a team, but now the hype train is there, if that makes sense. You know, with Giannis and Dame, you know, now they have one of those duos that is like a household name to everybody. Dame, in typical fashion, you know, got him some shots up today. We're about to check that out. Let's peep it. I'm not in Oh, that's cool. Mm. Good job. Uh, <laughs> So I just wanted to share that. I know the fans are excited to see Dame knocking down threes effortlessly. Granted, he's open. All pros do that. But Dame, we know what he does when he's between those lines and the way he closes game. So Milwaukee is going to have some of that hype that some of the other teams have had. They've been able to kind of fly under the radar. Like people will say it, it was weird with the Bucks. They would say they're going to the finals, but it was like, Mm, that hype wasn't quiet there. So when they failed, um, the, the backlash wasn't as strong either. But now, if this team doesn't get it done, just the way the media is, you know, um, they're going to say they had Middleton, Giannis, and Dame, and they couldn't get it done. So it's going to be expectations if they fail. You know, um, they won't be asking Giannis, is it a failure this year? They're going to be telling them, and that's a different type of pressure, but I just wanted to share that with you guys. Let me know what you think in the comments. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Till next time, peace.